Well, hello there, everyone. Welcome back. It's your local mermaid bitch here, and uh, I have uh, another different vlog. You've seen my na nature vlog where I was doing my book haul for some books um, with the songs Ballads and Snakes, something like that. So I'm going to do a different vlog, and this one is going to be another book haul. This is going to be like a gifted book haul. This is from my cousin, my aunt, and my sister. This is a, a book haul right here. And I have books to show you guys. My aunt and my cousin left to Florida. Sadly, I'm gonna miss them. But they gave me books. Um, and my sister threw out some books and I got them. So I'm gonna show you guys these books right now. It's gonna be like a short video. And let us begin. Like the first book is from my aunt. They're all in random order. So I'm just gonna tell you guys from who it is. My aunt gave me majority of her books are spanish so this is daniel Col goldman's la Intelli inteligencia emocional i've read some of this when she let me borrow it but i couldn't understand it all because i'm not i'm I'm very fluent with spanish and english and i write and read in spanish and english but since i haven't read any spanish based books in like years it's it's you know i have flaws <laughs> um the next book from her is dr kevin lehman's Musica entre las sabanas. So I believe that this is some sort of romance. And it says, oh, by the way, this is um, emotional intelligence. Then this is um, no intellectual emotion. This is music under the uh, under the blankets or under the sheets. The next book she gave me is Alquimia Emocional. Tara Bennett Goldman. Uh, I don't know what alquimia is. I think it's manage emotions, hopefully, emotionally. Um, it's a cute cover. It's a hefty one. Um, it has a little bird. It's most These books are self-help books that she's been reading. The next one, um, first of all, he is kind of cute. Um, it's, I think that's his name, Anko Perez, La Inteligencia del Éxito. This is The Intellectuality of uh, success. So I cannot wait to get through these. Um, the next book I have here is Aleph. Aleph. Paolo Colo. Aleph. What is that word? I don't know what this is. Um, I don't know what that word means. <laughs> so let's just call it a leaf or a leaf. A leaf. This is from my cousin. This I kind of cried about because, um, you know, me and my cousin went to the Strand bookstore with my sister and my other friend. And he got this and he left it and I guess now it's a book that I have to kind of be with. And this is The Quest for the Golden Apple, an unofficial graphic novel from Minecrafters by Megan Miller. He read this and now I, it's my turn to read it. Um, this is also for my aunt. This is Gabriel Garcia Marquez, El Amor en los Tiempos del, cole, del Colera. So, cholera. Uh, the Love in the Times of Cholera cholera the disease i believe i think this is about the disease cholera so that sounds interesting because i like learning about plagues um you know we're living in one right now the next book is actually for my cousin this is the first world war by hugh strachan and of course you guys know what this might be about it's literally the whole history of world war one um, I forgot what World War One was about. I think it was about Russia or something like that. I know Second World War is famous because of Hitler and Nazi. Um, this is my sister's book. This is Whatever After Abbey in Wonderland Special Edition. I have one of these books. Which one is it? I think I have... Um, I don't remember. Uh, but I have to collect the whole series because I have... there. In This is like the 11th or 12th book and the one that my sister gave me is like the sixth book so i have to start with one this is from my aunt this is masaya del marte y venus this is the title says um far from mars and venus so i think this is a romance contemporary um i cannot wait to read these books in spanish like i told myself that when i'm reading all of these books um i get to at least try to read a spanish book at least two two like once one every two months that way it's easy for me because i'm a slow reader in spanish uh but i'm an average reader in english the next book is for my sister this is the dog days of charlotte hayes by marlene kennedy so little cute puppy look how cute he is 
Then the next book is from my cousin. Um, this is Captain Underpants, uh, now in full color. I read Captain Underpants when I was a little kid, um, but I guess I'm going to start reading it again. And this is the full color edition. The next book I have here is, I think, from my cousin. This is Heart and Soul, the story of America and African Americans. I cannot wait to read this with my sister. I want to teach her more about the history of how we were back then. Well, how people were back then because I respect my fellow African Americans. They are everything. Um, then here I have Our Solar System by Seymour Simon. And this would be another fun one with my sister. She kind of likes science, I think. And I love science. So I get to teach her about the planets. The next... Oh, by the way, that was from my cousin. I think this is also from him. This is Hudson... Um, don't know much about it, but I think this guy's Henry Hudson. So we're going to find out who the hell he is and what he impacted. Oh, there's actually a book from my mom. I bought this for her, but she read it and she wants to give it to me. This is called Dolphins. Um, and it's about dolphins. Like, yes. <laughs> the next book I have here is... I, I, I wish I stood up with my tripod, but um, my grandma's living in this room, so I have to make my videos like on the floor or either in the living room, but the living room is empty, so this is the best bet I got. Um, this is, for my sister, this is weather, um, and this is about tornadoes and natural disasters, so can't wait to read that. Then I have Escape to Freedom. This is my cousin's book, and I think this based on the cover and the synopsis it's about slavery so i cannot wait to read this and then the final book oh this is actually from my little friend marlene marlene thank you so much marlene thanks so much cousin my aunt my sister and my mom for giving me these books i have not bought any except for the ones over there but um this is shakespeare stories illustrated and these are freaking illustrated man like Thanks to that little girl. She's a queen. Like, I cannot wait to read this. I love Shakespeare. And these are all the books. Um, Let me show my face. There we go. I'm a bald bitch. Yes. And I'm super happy I got all of these books. Um, Thanks to all of my family members and my friends. Y'all are all family to me. And I'm super excited to be reading all of these books. Um... You know, because it was passed down from all of them to me. Because, of course, I'm a book nerd. And I can't wait to finish and, you know, have fun with these books. But this is my vlog. I think I don't need to edit because I was talking way all the way through. But my grandma's about to come in this room. So I should end the vlog quickly because she was about to shower. And this was the only time I could make a video. So, as I keep saying, guys, keep on swimming, my little mermaids. Until next time, goodbye. Hopefully, you guys enjoyed this video. I enjoyed it, too. And I think I said goodbye already. So, <gasps> Bye. I'm a bald bat. Wait. Instead of saying I'm a bat. No. Boss ass bitch. I'm a bald ass bitch. Bitch. Bitch.